What's cracking, Collective? It's your Uncle 79, the Spiritual Savage. Here to check in with you. It's like uh, 314. Somebody in St. Louis is doing something fucking foul. I can tell. Yep, got bumps. Like, share, follow, hit that notification bell so you know when I post a video. What's up, baby? How you doing? How's your rising going, everybody? Great, 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 great. How's your ascension? Good, 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 I hope. So I hope it's going well. Give me one second. My bad. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. So I'm just coming to do a quick check in with you guys. Um, so I'd like to just um, do a quick return to sender. Ten times folk got it with love and light. Things that do not belong to the collective in me. Some motor be, some motor be, some motor be, and so it is. And as far as evil eyes are going, they gonna watch anyways. They gonna find a way to see whatever we're doing, wherever we are, and any shit we can really do about it. So we'll just do a return to center. That's just a quick energy send back. I always guide with love and light so that it doesn't come back to you in the wrong way. You feel me? All right, so check it. I got a download, um, a few of them actually, but one that I feel like is very significant and important is the fact that you cannot be distracted by these uh, these clones, these draconians, these draconians as I like to call them. But the draconians, draconians, do not be, do not be uh, allow the distractions from uh, from these reptilians consume your focus now we've all been guilty i mean i'll just speak for myself i have been guilty of uh, maybe losing focus along my along the way um being distracted by other things instead of paying attention to what's the most important and what's most important to you you have to figure that out use your discernment i can't tell you what's more what's what's the most important thing for you to be doing at this point i can only go by what i should be doing 144 was on the clock as i said that but I'm just trying to get you to understand the fact that it's bigger than me. It's bigger than you. It's bigger than the bullshit that's going on outside of your house. It's bigger than the argument that you're about to probably have with your boo or your bae. It's bigger than a lot of things. It's about the ascension of earth. It is about stopping things that no longer serve our highest good. You know, the things that prevent earth from ascending. The things that prevent our communities from growing, our knowledge to, uh, to expand. And for... Uh, and just for the overall consciousness of the world to, to be of a, of, a, of a higher frequency. So we can send off a higher vibration so that it can reach all, all across the world. It's, you know, throughout the galaxy, throughout the globe. I mean, for real though, I did watch the, uh, the Disclosure um, special that was on uh, Gaia. And basically, like there, there, there's, there are uh, alien being alien life forms, and I hate to say alien life forms because I feel like I'm one of them. So I'm just gonna say, let's just say for lack of the argument, alien life forms, extraterrestrial beings. All right, you, there are extraterrestrial beings out there in this in the galaxy that are just waiting for us to communicate with them the right way. We don't communicate with them through words. We communicate with them uh, with them through tele tele uh, tele te with the third eye. This is fucking retrograde. Uh, Mercury retrograde ain't no punk bitch, is it? But we we uh, communicate with them through telepathy, through meditation. And so, you know, if we're not on that frequency, then they don't even get it. They don't even hear it. And so, it's important that we that we. I mean, I, I have to admit, I don't. It's hard for me to meditate. I have not. I've never uh, was in the habit of meditating. It just wasn't my thing. But I mean, I've done it. You know, I've kind of gotten a couple of successful five to seven minute uh, meditation. Uh, uh, you know what do you call that meditation what sessions meditation sessions in and it was you know it was it was actually really nice i just think it's because of the energy that surrounds where i live that makes it kind of um impossible to kind of not impossible because nothing is impossible what i put my mind to it but it does make it a bit harder when the energy is to do is so dense and it's so cloudy and it's so nasty around you it's so negative that it's it, it to do like 10 minutes worth of meditation for me probably would drain the fuck out of me for like three days so all i'm pretty much saying is that we are constantly being offered distractions in the world and especially on youtube okay i, I can't i can't talk about it enough there are very sp specific people on here and i don't even need to name them that are totally wasting your time you are giving them all of this energy for them to just turn around and use it as vitriol to spit at other people who are actually trying to help the collective. You have to use your discernment to figure out who those people are. I, I mean, I, I, I clearly can see certain things. I mean, my job is to just report, report the messages that come from the most high. You know, to give my little two, two or two to three, five cents on what, what my spin on it is and hope that you can, you know, that you vibe with me on it. But I mean, overall, you have people that are, uh, that are pissed off right now. Because you have people like me coming out uh, calling these motherfuckers out. 
And we don't even need to call him by name. All you got to do is pay attention to see who gets mad. <laughs> I'm just telling the truth. Steve, you start talking shit. You know, if it ain't one thing, it's another. You'll be attacked on all ends. Anybody that's of the collective is not going to attack you. Anybody of the collective is not going to launch a smear campaign, sit on a, sit on a channel and talk shit about everybody. Um, if anything, what like people could say, well, you talk shit. No, what I do is I tell the truth. And I just have my, my style of telling the truth. But I don't single out people, post that, you know, and let that be the... You know, you know what I'm saying. I don't even need to explain that shit. I don't need to explain any motherfucking thing. Because if you know, you know. If you don't, you don't. Don't start no shit with nobody. There won't be no shit with nobody. And that's really what I'm saying. The collective people that are of a higher vibration, a high, a high frequency and a high vibration will not do that to you. Even if you're wrong. Even if you make a mistake. No, you will not be attacked like that. People of, the, of, of a high frequency, again, with a high vibration, will, will, will handle you with love and care and honesty and respect. Of a high vibration and a high frequency. So just keep that in mind. All right. We're not out here competing with one another. We're out here collaborating with one another. Either physically, spiritually, or energetically. We're doing it. So beware of people out here that are just out here to try to drag you into these little sick ass fucking covens that they have. So they can sex traffic at you. Uh, sex traffic you. Organ traffic you. Help you, uh, help you get, get them to traffic fucking children. Money laundering. It's all just one. It's all... These spiritualists are being used to suck people in to get them to stand behind the bullshit that's tearing the world apart. And if you can't see that, I don't know what else to say. Open up your fucking eyes. And I mean that shit. You know, I'm, 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 I'm still in a good mood, but I'm very serious about that shit. I'm very serious about what I'm talking about. Because this is happening and, and, it's acting, and everyone's acting like they can't fucking see it. The shit is fucking happening. There are these covens, there are these groups of people that are, are trafficking people, trafficking children, organ trafficking, laundering money, stealing and swapping identities, murdering people, and no, everybody's acting like they don't fucking see it. And that's a fucking shame. Let me get a card, please. The moon. Yeah. They're trying to keep secrets quiet, but secrets are being revealed. That's why they're scared. Yep. Confession. I can't make this up. Somebody's confessing to the police. They are. Let me just, uh, let me see if I can. There we go. Yep. Somebody. Somebody's confessing to the police right now as we speak. Mm hmm. You got to know that. That's the seven of needles. They've been caught. They're being held accountable. It's in the reverse. Let's see what they. Yeah. They're confessing about, they're confessing about how they oppress, how they oppress people and cause endings. We have oppression and endings and addictions. Gave people addictions. Mm -hmm. And we're proud about it because you have a claim behind it. And they did it for friendship. Friendship could be considered a partnership or, or be, becoming a part of a group. Yeah. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Somebody's confessing about all that shit. About oppressing people, causing endings, uh, c creating addictions for people. Even maybe their addiction. Drugs. Like how they got everybody heavily involved in drugs to traffic them for sex trade. That's what I'm trying to tell you. This is what actually happens to people. Yeah, and they were and they and they were happy about it. At the time they didn't what's the big deal? It happened to me. It happened to you so you do it to somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Just cuz your dumb ass fucking friend said let's do it, you do it. Yeah. Well, I'm telling you collective be that friend that says don't do it. People remember that shit and they really do. When it I don't know if they remember it may not remember it when you want them to remember it, but they will remember it. Whoever's confessing right now, I'm trying to tell you right now, whoever's confessing, whoever decided to talk to the law heard me say, "You know what? You do what the fuck is right." Don't do what you're afraid of. Do what is right. You know what I'm saying? That's how I feel about it. Shit, feel me? That's some dumbass shit. Now I'm very irritated about that shit because people, I don't understand like what kind of how, what kind of world we live in, where people will take people and sell other people. Then and it be black fucking people. Let me get another card. Somebody's wishes are coming true. The Empress, I guess. I don't know. How, I guess I should say, okay, yeah, sure. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. It's like, this. these are the things you distract us from things that are going to make us feel better. So if you are an Empress, if you're walking in your Empress energy, your wishes are coming true. You may not feel like it right now, but it is. Just be patient, shit. Let me get another card. Accomplishment. New love. So there's a, an accomplishment coming with new love. That's always good. There's some heartbreaker that's very hopeless right now. 
that's curious about what you're doing by yourself because you're in isolation. Yeah, they're acting impulsive, so they're probably coming to look for you, which is stupid. All right, just don't open the door. Let the motherfucker stand outside. They start kicking doors and shit. Call the police. They're probably already sitting outside your house any fucking way. Need another card. They can't let go. You cut off a narc and then they lose their fucking mind. That's the truth. Yeah, yielding, independence, overbearing. See, somebody, somebody is trying to. Really, at the end of the day, what happens is this: you you break away from a narc. A narcissist, anybody that's trying to steal an energy vampire, and you have been their, their, their one soul supply, you have a lot of light within you, you illuminate a lot of rooms, cities, fucking nightclubs, it don't matter where you are, you illuminate, from everybody, can, people can see your light from miles away, and you walk away from a fucking energy vampire, G, what else do they do? Your light is so bright, they didn't have any other ones, because everybody come, likes like moths, I'm trying to tell you, moths and... But, Turn on a light in, a, in a, turn on a light in your home and apartment, and turn off all the rest of them. Just keep one light on and turn and open up your window. You gonna look out that window? You probably gonna freak the fuck out. As many bugs will be on that window because of the light. They're attracted to the light because they they're in fucking dark. They're in the darkness all damn time, all the damn time. Man, this is crazy. But yeah, they're curious about your isolation, like who you're with, because you're not talking to them. You cut them off. You've gone into hermit mode. Mm-hmm. Yep. You isolated yourself, and and it's different than going going within. Cause in the upright, this is going within. So you you can go within and do you do do your you know her, going to going to hermit mode to go within without isolating yourself. But you've totally cut yourself the fuck off from everybody. And congratulations, congratulations. Sometimes you have to do that to even stay safe, to keep your whole aura, to keep your energy field safe. Because everybody's so forceful with it, they don't have bound. They don't have boundaries. They don't give a fuck about what the fuck you're asking them to do or not do. People are just gonna do it because they're used to you being a pushover. They're used to you being a people pleaser, a healer. But now that you're walked away from them, how they healing? Who's healing them now? The, the Billsy Bub, and he ain't healing them. He he's laughing at them. Yep. Now they're realizing they done fucked up. They're realizing they ch uh, chose the wrong side. But you told them that they were warned. Mm-hmm. But they didn't give a fuck about it. The only reason why they've... Listen, Collective 1221, they are finally seeing who the fuck they are. That's a mirroring moment. And I'm going to tell you again, the only real reason why they realize that they chose the wrong side is because you didn't fucking die. Or end up in prison. That's the truth, Ruth. Yep. Foresight. You used your foresight in this situation. Yeah. Uncontrolled exclusion. Somebody's being forced out. Somebody's being forced out of this shit. Mm -hmm. and that's the end of that somebody's being forced out of this coven this secret society group whatever somebody's been kicked the fuck out mm -hmm. finality I can't make it up finality somebody got kicked somebody else got kicked the fuck out that's what they get hold on let me grab I'll use this uh, the radiant uh, rider weight tarot deck let's see if we can pull some signs on who got kicked the fuck out who got who got excluded, uncontrolled, so they were fired. Maybe somebody just got fired. There's a lot of firing going on today. I'm trying to tell you. Oh, excuse the fuck out of you, nasty pig. <laughs> You're a nasty pig. Okay. <sighs> Take a deep breath, Dwayne. Ah, so hard for me. Like it, 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 it really kind of angers me, because this is. And this is why it's so important for us to come together as a community and to cut ourselves off from energy vampires and narcissists and devil worshippers and luciferians because we need to be building communities of people so that we can uh, each one teach one village style shit have schools that to prepare people because who I wasn't prepared for this growing up and they knew I wasn't going to be prepared for it that's why they didn't prepare me for it makes sense right they want us to be broke. They want us to be homeless. They want us to be downtrodden, uneducated. They want us to be naive. They want us to be stupid. They want us to be unable to defend ourselves when these motherfuckers hit us with some dark magic. Because people aren't f uh, fist fighting no more. They are, they're, they're going into the spirit to duke it out. And if you're unaware of what goes on as, as above, so is below, then you're fucked. That's a sign. Two of Pentacles. This could be an Earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus. The guy, they didn't could they couldn't manage the shit that they said that they was gonna do. They couldn't manage the coven. They dropped, they fumbled, they literally fumbled the bag. And so they got fired. Let me get another, let me get another, who, let me get another sign, please. 
and, and you know what? And be careful. I don't really give up. I'm going to just keep it 100. Get away from people attached to really horribly negative people. And, and, and I'm telling you now, there was a point in time where I was attached to horribly negative people. Okay? So, they were all horribly negative, so they didn't mind being around each other. That's why I removed myself and I stopped talking to these people. And you can't be mad at nobody that is that loves you and cares about you or cares about themselves if they walk away from you because you are surrounded by negative ass people or, or narc ass people or low vibrational people or fucking child molestators, pedophiles, murderers, drug dealers. Hey, and I ain't, I, hey, we've all had a past, but I'm not talking about like no pedo, no, I'm talking about drug past. It, it's a, it, I get it. Sometimes people do things to make money, sell drugs, use drugs, whatever. But when it comes to, and I'm saying people who sell drugs, and because it's dangerous, you don't know what they're trying to put you in. You don't know if they're going to get shot up. You don't know if they're going to get robbed. That's what I'm talking about. But when you're around motherfucking pedophiles and fucking murderers, let me tell you, uh, let me tell you real quick. You become birds of a feather flock together. Even if you're not of the same energy, you're still around them. You see, that's how that works. And uh, listen, and. and I don't know. I'm, I'm, all I'm pretty much trying to say is that I, I, I'm, I would, if I, I, there have been times that I would look at a friend of mine and go, I could see what their, I could hear what their man was thinking. I could see the way he looked at a little, like a little kid or somebody that was just inappropriate. I see the way they even looked at me sometimes, and I would just be like, you, you don't see, like, bitch, you don't see that, or you just acting like you don't see it. I could never be with somebody that I saw them doing that and and, and be okay with that. You'd have to walk away. And I would seriously question the judgment of anybody or the, or the motives or, their, or the alliance of anybody that fought hard for somebody that they knew was molesting children, raping men or women, tr sex trafficking people, organ trafficking people, setting people up for life insurance. I would, I would seriously question the, the alliance, whether they were of a high vibration or of a low vibration, whether they worship my dad or him downstairs. For if people that were defended people that they know goddamn well are, have, done, have done these horrible fucking crimes. That's why I don't talk to none of it. I don't talk to anybody from the past no more because they were all a part of this bullshit. Give me another card, please. Yeah, you you might be a little bit afraid to, to take that fool's journey alone, but you got to do it because if you don't do it, you're going to you but fucking you're going to end up dead or in prison or, or or living on the streets like they want you to be. Mm-hmm. Your your ass gonna be calm. I can't make it up. Three. A water sign. Mm-hmm. Told you. Three. Because it takes three to get to, to really kick off some dark magic. It takes three ugly wicked bitches or three little dick warlocks. Yep, I can't make it up. The air is pointing downward. Dark magic. Let me, let me another one. Three of cups, please. And I still got work to do. I don't know every fucking thing. You know what I'm saying? I, I got a lot, a hell of a lot of work to do. Which is why, you know, I'm scaling back on my postings because I, how can I communicate things to you all to help you all grow if I don't, if I'm not fully equipped myself, you know, there's a lot of things I need to learn. A lot of stuff I just, I just have a, a, a precognizant knowledge of, you know, esoteric kind of shit, but there's some things I need to learn. Yep. what I just say? another one let's get another one because somebody's in indecision about what so I, I did ask for the signs though there could be a virgo but this popped out when i was talking about going within if you're unsure about that yeah well they're not unsure about doing bad work to, when they come together doing bad work on your ass yeah that's a fucked up ass but that's a fucked up ass threesome group of people coming together for some money now this could mean that they have been dismantled but as we all know they're like gremlins they don't die they multiply like roaches and shit dead ass so somebody's in an indecision about communicating something, maybe sending a message, an email, posting, maybe posting something online. Somebody's at an indecision about it. Consult God. Do it. Because no, go to God first. Mm-hmm. Maybe you want maybe you want to post something or let me see what this is about. Okay, I, I'm picking up on the fact that whoever sees this video is on the fence about communicating, posting something online about something that's. Let me get that. Uh, I'm picking up. Uh, what am I? Whether or not you should tell the truth about something. 
maybe about what I'm talking about. Yep, about somebody being a bully. About somebody playing unfairly. About how some spiritual leader 2002 is on the clock. There's a mirroring effect. I'm trying to tell you. So about how maybe a spiritual leader is not is not doing what's right. Is taking advantage of people. Being a bully. Using their power. What? Using their power. Strength follows that. Mm-hmm. Using their power, their strength, using their position, you know, their unfair advantage, then using their strength, then using their money for people to make poor judgments or casting bad judgment on people. Mm hmm. So people don't get the judgment they deserve because they're using their money. They're using their unfair. They're using their, 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 their standing. They're, they're, they're standing amongst people. Their social standard. They're not their standard, their social position. What is that called? social class whatever you know what the fuck i'm saying they are big they, they have a high stand they're a community they're like a community pillar they're a pillar in the fucking community they could be like a fucking mayor they could be like a fucking senator they could be like p for police or police or a police sergeant they could be a fucking bishop they could be a fucking priest or a, mi a minister they could be a newscaster i could go on and on they could work at a fucking community center yep and they got and, and they use that as leverage to control people take for money i'm trying to tell you that's what it is they, so they can control they, they can tr control the unfavorable outcome in court cases. People believe in when, when they, if a person goes say this person did that, they use their money. Mm -hmm. They use their money to buy them out. Yep. They don't know because the, ju the justice system is not going to believe it. People are going to cast judgment upon the person that goes and says, I didn't do that. Or they did this to me. You know, they're not going to believe it because they got money and they got power. They, they strong arm people. They strong arm people with their money and, and, and their social standing. Mm hmm. It forces people to walk away. That's like that's all they want. They want people to walk away, or they walk away. And these are all the victims of the people that they fucking hurt. That's the truth, Ruth. That's what I just heard. Need another card, please. The kids. Yep. This is this is twenty two twenty two one o'clock. They see they can finally see who the fuck they are. Balance is being restored. Look at that. This is what they're giving children. They're creating generational curses instead of breaking them. This is why this shit, I'm trying to tell you, man, this shit is getting, this shit is sickening as fuck. I am about to get out this shit. Low vibrational ass emperor, a, 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 a karmic masculine. What about him? Looking for somewhere else, low vibrational to go. Somewhere that's going to accept his low vibrational ass. He's probably on the run now. He probably don't know what to do because he knows them, them four walls is coming around on his ass. Time for him to get the fuck up out of where he is. Yep, Sweet Dick Willie. What'd I say? And that, look, at Sweet Dick Willie with the reptilian right behind him. See? Yep. He's cold. He don't care about nobody. Like when I say he's cold, he's cold motherfucking blooded. Everybody got a price. See, I'm trying to tell you. He been doing this. Now he's caught. Look, he going off to run, to run off somewhere to finesse somebody else. Mm-hmm. Could be a water sign. So I'm trying to tell you, he waiting on them, waiting on them flying monkeys to come in, or waiting on his other, uh, waiting on the two other wands to come in, so they can go do what they do to usually, and, and sneak away, not get caught. What I tell you? What I tell you? Where they at? Thank you. <laughs> That's where they at. Tower in the reverse. God's coming through to whoop your motherfucking ass, G. Yep, that's happening. It's happening. LAX. I just saw LAX. LAX. Los Angeles. Whoa. Los Angeles. LAX. Somebody just flew, landed in LAX, or flew out of LAX. I'm picking up. They just landed in LAX. They got the fuck from where they was at. LAX. Somebody just landed in LAX not that long ago. That's what I just heard. Anyway, close out the reading. Like, share, follow. Hit that notification bell so you know when I post a video. That could be something that you could be interested in. This is the uh, Uncle 7-9, the Spiritual Savage. 
the Jack of Clubs, Dwayne Lamar Bowery, dropping these gems for you. Collective, be careful. Watch your kids, for real. Watch your kids. Don't let anybody around your motherfucking kids. Don't let nobody babysit your babies. And shit, don't know nobody babysit your grown ass after you done had a few drinks. You might wake up in the back of a truck with a with a eye with t- tied down to a table with an IV in your arm and, and something. Shut up, Dwayne. I'm just saying, that's how they do it. Or you wake up in a motherfucking tub full of ice, you know, and and, and, and your liver and organs and shit is gone. I'm trying to tell you, man, this shit. I look. I'm I'm just I'm just as shocked as you are that this shit really fucking goes down the way it goes down. And that's because we, we live so we live we, we do what the matrix does and we live we either live lives that people don't care about. That's why they don't give a fuck about all these people out here using drugs. They don't. Because these are the for, these are forgotten people. This this is what the world says. They ne- they'll never get better. They'll never get off drugs. We'll just leave them. They're going to die anyway. They're just going to die. If we don't ever see them again, we won't we won't be concerned cuz they use drugs. But what they really doing is that they selling their fucking family members for organs, sex, Whatever they're buying, whatever, cause they're like just go down to just go down to that bus the bus station down the street. He down there. How much you want for him? We got all his documents. Here you go. They take that little five G's and they sell their little brother. That's our sister, and they sell them in the sex in the sex trade. That's what I'm trying to tell you. That's why they don't care about these people smoking club fetty on these bus stops, right outside for the world to see. Cause the world don't want to see it, so the world just the world ignores it. Hell, I don't want to see it, so I just try to act like I, what am I? I mean, we grown, and 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 that drug is a very strong drug you can't just go grab somebody off the street and say man you need to stop doing that because they ain't even gonna be there that's a shame somebody just somebody just flew into lax though they're they're in the, they're into the industry not the, the music industry i'm not saying that i'm saying that they are on the run whoever 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 knew that tower was coming flew i'm here in southeast flew from southeast to the west that's what i just heard mississippi what i just heard Alabama, Mississippi, somewhere out there. They from a church too. All right, uh, I'm gonna let y'all go. Like, share, follow, hit that notification bell. Take a deep breath. We're just gonna return to center all that negative energy so that we can rest well and we can relax and we can see the bigger picture. We don't get caught by the distractions. Archangel Michael, please protect us. God, please protect us. Please give us the the light that we need. Please give us the encouragement that we need. Please give us the strength and understanding and understanding and wisdom that we need to get to tomorrow. To make better choices. Thank you. I mean, I say, I mean, I say. I can't wait till this retrograde is over. All right, y'all, I'm out. Baby, I love you, kiddo. I love you too. Deuces.